Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be organizing all of my Bath & Body Works in this cabinet. And I'm going to be using these little shelf dividers that I got off of Amazon. Typically these are used to organize like purses and stuff, but I have this bright idea to separate my fragrances by the season and use these to keep them divided. Yeah, so we'll see how that goes. As you guys can see, I have a lot of fine fragrance mists to organize. A little bit about these dividers. I believe they were like $14 or something like that. It came with four of them, but I gave two to my mom so she could organize her shelves because I only need two. Yeah, they're super affordable and I will have them linked in the description if anybody is interested. But I think the first thing I need to do is take everything off of the shelf. I don't know, but we're going to figure it out. Before we get started, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Now let's I'm gonna start taking everything off. I'm always reorganizing something. Like, I just can't keep things the same for a long time. I don't know. I just can't do it. Okay, so I cleaned off this shelf and just if anybody's wondering, this shelf is from Target. It was gifted to me from my aunt and I did not install the little back thing because I like this white brick wall that's behind it. I really, really like it. So I want to see it. So I didn't cover it up. So yeah, that's that about that. Now let's see if these even fit because I didn't even check before I started this video. Oh, they fit perfect. They fit really nice. Okay. So here's the other one. They actually have this little piece of rubber at the bottom so that they can like stay in place and not slide back and forth. So, yeah, um, uh-oh, I think I did need one more and I already gave it to my mom. We're going to do winter and spring in the center because I, I mean, to me, those two go hand in hand and then I'll do fall and then winter. Okay, let's go through. So first, what I'm going to do, since I'm already over here and I want to put winter over here, I'm going to go through my fragrances and show you guys all of my winter scents or fragrances that I consider to be winter scents. Oh my gosh, why is this kind of hard? Okay, so we have Dream Bright. This is kind of all year round, but it did come out in the winter time and I am going to have to make some tough decisions because I can't just put everything everywhere and this has that vanilla and it has the berries I don't know I think it'll, I think it'll go with winter so I'm gonna put it right there I have fireside flurries a good winter scent I also like to use that scent in the fall as well depending on if it's a cold day or not um then we have what else oh my gosh okay um that's kind of fall hmm Okay, we have Strawberry Snowflakes, and I have a backup of this, so I'm going to put the backup all the way in the back, and then we have a backup of Pure Wonder. I'm also going to put that all the way in the back, because I have one that's already being used that I can put up front. Um, <laughs> ah, this is kind of hard. Okay, I have Vanilla Bean Noel, Winter. What else? Oh my gosh. Okay, mm, this is kind of hard. Okay, I have a backup of Snowflakes and Cashmere. I can go back there. Um, oh, girl, this is already this is already so freaking hard. Okay, then we have a thousand Christmas wishes winter. Um, another backup of Pure Wonder. Then we have. Into the Stars, In the Stars is literally all year round for me, but I'm going to put her over here with my winter scents. And then we have, what else can I put over here? Oh my god, okay. We have Hope Winter Peach Marshmallow Winter. And then we have Winter Berry Wonder, obviously, Winter. Frosted Coconut Snowball, a good winter scent. And then I'm going to put Cozy Vanilla Bourbon in my winter scents, even though that can definitely be used in the fall, as well as Vanilla Mocha Cream. And then I also have, where's that other one? I have um, the one that came out with Cozy Vanilla Bourbon. Where did I put that? I actually realized that I have some more scents that I need to go get because I have some on the shelf that I forgot about. Oh my goodness. 
this is the last of it now i officially have off my bath and body works i completely forgot that i had stuff over there okay so another one that can go on the shelf is be enchanted this one all year round for sure but like i said we got to make some decisions here goes the one that i was looking for fresh vanilla blossoms also going on the shelf i love fresh vanilla blossoms and cozy vanilla bourbon those are so good um what else okay hmm this is so hard this is actually harder than i thought it was gonna be okay i'm gonna put champagne toast over here with my winter scents and i'm also gonna put into the night over here with my winter scents and what else can i put over here i think that's it i love this okay this is coming out good so far okay let me just organize these a bit better because i want yeah and i have space love that okay now moving on to summer spring i'm gonna try to separate them a little bit but not too much because there's literally not too much that can be done oh my goodness what about ice lemon pound cake spring spring that's gonna be spring and then we have gingham gorgeous spring i'm gonna put that on my spring i have backups of ice lemon pound cake so the backup is gonna go on the back this one's gonna be up front and then I have this new scent, the Bridgerton Diamond of the Season. And this one smells like mangoes to me. And I'm going to put this right in the middle because I would wear that either or. Doesn't really matter. I have a backup. Is this a backup? Yeah, this is a backup. I have a backup of Sweet Petal Pound Cake that will also go in the back. They're re-releasing Iceland and Pound Cake. I wonder if they're re-releasing Sweet Petal Pound Cake because I actually really, really love both of those scents. Um... We have Midsummer Dream going on the summer section. And then we have Sweetheart Cherry. I'm going to put this in the winter. Yeah, I'm going to put that with the winter scents. I'm also going to put You're the One in the winter scents as well. Yeah. And then we have Sunshine Mosa Summer. Hmm. I don't know. Okay. No, that's fall. Uh, else? okay butterfly we putting that with my spring scents we have boardwalk taffy that's summer we have beachfront blanket summer cocoa paradise uh, triple berry martini this is pomegranate juice black raspberry liqueur and strawberry sugar hmm I'm gonna put her with my spring and then we have a thousand wishes this one is pink prosecco sparkling kinks crystal peonies gilded amber and amaretto cream i'm gonna put this with winter yeah i'm gonna put that with my winter scents and then here's my pure wonder that's in use I also have Twinkling Nights. This one is Frosted Jasmine Petals with Vanilla and Mandarin Blossoms. Hmm. I'm feeling like putting her over here. Okay, now we have Meet Me in Miami, Summer. Um, Among the Clouds. I'm going to say right in the middle. Like, it's right there. And then we have Bubbly Rosé. This one is Pink Sparkling Rosé sweet blood orange and a splash of cranberry i'm feeling like she could go with the spring scents you know and then life of the party this one is pink citrus bubbly prosecco jasmine and vanilla i'm guessing i'll put her over here um I, I don't know this but we're gonna keep it going i have at the beach that's gonna go with my summer scents and then this way I can see like what scents I can actually buy. Like, oh, I don't have a lot of, you know, summer scents. Maybe I can buy some when there's a sale or whatever. And then we have coconut co copper coconut sands. Love that one, by the way. And that is for the summer for me. And then we have poolside cabana, which is also summery. I have another backup of ice lemon pound cake. So I'm going to put that one to the back. And then we have strawberry town cake, which is also going to go for spring for me. 
Or should I go? Mm, I actually like to wear this in the fall. I'm just going to set that over there. I also have Groovy Watermelon Summer. Because that's when I want to smell like a groovy watermelon. Um, okay, Gingham Love. See, th this one, this one, and yeah, these two. Okay, I changed my mind. I'm actually changing my mind. I'm going to put these with the spring because it's kind of giving spring. It's more than it's giving winter. So we're going to put those over here. And what else? Okay, we have Summer Melody. That is like one of my favorite scents ever. And I'm putting that with the summer. And then we have Confetti Daydream. I actually like to wear that one in the summer as well. And then Mad About You. Hmm. And it doesn't have the notes on the back because this is the old, old one. Um, so I'm going to put that with Spring, I guess. I'm also going to put Gingham with my Spring some recents. I have a lot of spring scents and a lot of winter scents. Not as many summer scents as I thought. Okay. Here goes my sweet petal pound cake that's open. And then I also have champagne sprinkles. I'm going to put this with my spring summery scents. And then pastel skies is summery for me. And then I have Sunset Glow, which is giving summer nights. So I'm just going to put that right there. And then the rest should be fall. So let's see. I Look, I did not I did not think this video was going to be as fast as it was. Because it looks like I have so much Bath & Body Works. But I guess I don't have as much as I thought I had. So I'm going to put Golden Eclipse with the fall. Cozy evening. I'm putting that in the front because that's one of my favorites. And we have um, blueberry sugar pancakes, ivory cashmere. That's a really good one. Wicked vanilla woods. Moonlight path for me is giving fall. Fairy tale. Then we have enchanted candy potion. Midnight Amber Glow, Little Black Party Dress, love that one, and we have Chasing Flyer, what? Chasing Fireflies, Pink Suede, wait a minute, wait, I don't know, this one is Blush Berries, Velvet Peonies, and Soft Cotton, that one I can wear in the spring or in the summer, in my opinion, I, I don't know. And then I have Wrapped in Vanilla. That's a really good one. And then we have some. We only have four more left. Oh my gosh. This is all my fragrances. I cannot believe it. Everlasting Magic. Definitely Fall. Midnight Spell. Fall. And then we have Whipped Coconut Milkshake. Fall. Yeah. And then Vampire Blood. Yeah. Okay, that's literally it. So now these will keep them separate so I can know where everything is. So in the summer, in the spring, I know to shop my stash right here. In the winter, I know to shop my stash right over here. And in the fall, I can shop my stash over here. Now this bottom shelf is so chaotic. I feel like even though I don't have a system going down here I can do a little bit better like it don't have to look like this so I'm gonna try to organize it a little bit not a lot just a little bit cuz it is it is what it is let's see so all of my body lotion are over here I need to stop buying body lotions because why do I have so many I'm not organizing the body lotions. I'm just going to put them down here because, oh, I need to pull that out. Blush Cardigan was my, that girl. That was, it was that girl for me. Um, also really love Into the Stars. I always call it Into the Stars. It's in the stars. Okay. So, body lotions. And then I need to, okay, let's put 
these over here too. Um, we need a section for Sol de Janeiro. She needs her own little section. I don't have that many, but I got some. Oops. I do have a few of those. And then my... Okay, you just gonna keep falling. So we gonna move you. We have my Victoria's Secrets. Those can go over here. this Victoria's Secrets and I lost the top and I never found it again I feel like why haven't I found this like it can only be back here I move stuff around all the time so I just don't understand why I haven't found it but this is Tropic Vanilla and it smells so good there we go okay. Ellis Brooklyn sent over this fragrance and I think I mentioned it on this channel already but y'all I'm gonna mention it again because this thing could be thangin', okay? It smells so good. If you love peaches, please go smell this next time you're at, I think it's at Sephora. I think they even sell it at Ulta too. Smell this, y'all. I am not exaggerating. This smells so good. And it's a fragrance mess, but it smells like a perfume. It is so nice. It is, it is so nice. And then the, the bottle... The bottle is glass, so you know it's all nice. I keep it in the box because I don't know, it's kind of sentimental to me because this is the first fragrance that a brand has ever sent me. So I'm keeping it in the box. And I'm gonna put her over there with my fragrances from Victoria's Secrets, I guess. I do have some body shimmers, so let me just put those right here. Have too many, but I do have a few, so let's just keep them right here. And then my Sol de Janeiro's can go right here. I feel like I'm missing one. I'm definitely missing one. Am I? I don't know. Maybe not. I have a lot of space down here. What if I? I need a. I need a organ. I need to figure out what I'm doing down here for real. Okay, so these are going to be all together. This is almost done. I probably have like one more use left in that. And we have some body oils. They can go right here. Love this Capari. And I love my Sunday Riley Fairy Godmother. And this, you'd be surprised. This, I found this, I found this at Marshall's. It was $4.99 and it is so bomb. It smells good and it has the prettiest little shimmer. And then I got this one from Beauty Creations. They have a Beauty Creations at a mall near me. So I picked this up because I'm so, I just love body shimmers. So I saw it and I was like, yeah, I want it. So I got it. And yeah, I finished. That's it. Look how cute. I love these dividers. They're so nice. So this is how it turned out. I really like it. I think it's so cute. I really love how organized it is. And yeah, these def these dividers definitely came in handy. But that's the end of this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in my next video.